These are times rappers got caught up in the wrong hood and checked by goons. And we gotta start with the baby because in 2018, the baby was in East Atlanta filming a music video for his song 21. He linked up with a film team and got to work. But I in remember the middle that. of working, a bunch of that goons video went viral rolled up and Facebook. tried to press him. The film crew shot the whole interaction. And you can see a bunch of dudes walk up to the spot while the baby's trying to work. They stood across the street and started questioning the baby, asking him where his permission slip was since he was in their hood. The baby told the dudes nobody signed the permission slip <laughs> for him. And one of the goons clapped back and said, I gotta see something. Yeah, this is my city, baby. Ain't nobody signed up a business slip for me. Mm -mm. Huh? Oh, yeah. I ain't know that. Oh, okay. The baby was outnumbered <laughs> in this situation, but he didn't back down at all since the dudes didn't come at him with respect. Check out what I'm saying. I ain't no peewee though, so we don't, it don't go like that. It gotta be respect. It gotta be respect. You see what I'm saying? That's all it is. It gotta be respect. Look, nah, nah, nah. Y'all just come, y'all get respect. Y'all would've got the utmost respect. You see what I say? What's good with y'all? Y'all like That had to be like things in 2018. And just a because month after this happened, the baby, a dude no, in Walmart, who tried like robbing him. But he got off on this Comment case since it was self-defense. And in 2019, DJ Mad asked the baby out in, in an interview if he thought the situation in Atlanta could have gone wrong. Hold and on, the baby told that, him because it was self-defense. And in 2019, DJ Vlad asked the baby in an interview if he thought the situation oh, in Atlanta could have gone wrong. Yeah, that did happen and the baby told him, what you guys would show up and ask you for a permission slip? <laughs> I think they actually use those words. Yeah, that's what he said. Yeah. So I mean, he I said, mean, where's your permission slip? Did you feel that <laughs> it could have it could have gone wrong? That guy was on their side. That guy was on their side. You know I mean? It worked out perfect for him. Man, but the baby situation crazy. is nothing compared to what happened with NLA he Chopper. He said guy was Boy on their side. First, let's talk about the time NBA Youngboy got checked while shooting a video in L.A. Because he was filming in an area called Watts. And apparently, some oh. locals weren't having it. So they pulled up to press him and his people. A video of what went down shows Youngboy angrily walking around a crowd of people and repeating, You heard me, Big E. While a car drives by full of dudes hanging out the windows yelling at him. And that's when someone in the NBA crew allegedly pulled out his rod. The dudes in the car dug down and drove off. And the crowd watching the scene ran away oh. screaming. Ooh, they about to blink them boys down. The video cuts out there, and thankfully, nothing bad happened in this situation. But that wasn't the only time Youngboy almost what had an issue in L.A. Later that same month, a dude rapping Bounty Hunter Watts Bloods tried to press Youngboy while he was walking down the street. It's not clear how it started, but Youngboy and the other dude started yelling back and forth with each other while Youngboy's partner held him back. Another video shows Youngboy and the dude yelling at each other again at a different spot. Young boy was trying to get at the dude, but his partner held him back. And the other dude wasn't really trying to make a move. The video cuts off before the situation ends, but nothing really happens since Young Boy's team was there to keep it cool. And speaking of Young Boy, he also Why has goons all over the world who aren't afraid to check like. people for him. Because after Look, Young Boy dropped like the song, project. Bring the Hook, dissing Oblock and King Von, everyone close to Von had something to say about it. And after DJ Academics made a tweet saying NBA Young Boy on Demon Time right now, it made things worse. Because Lil Reese responded by saying, that ain't no Demon Time, he just rapping like the rest of these rappers all rap. And Ali Chopper then agreed with Lil Reese saying, I stamped that. Chopper was basically letting it be known which side he was rocking with in this beef after he made that tweet. But in Ali Chopper probably yeah, didn't realize that Youngboy has one of the craziest fan bases in the world. So while Chopper was at the airport waiting to catch his flight, <laughs> one of Youngboy's fans slash wannabe goons pulled up on Chopper imagine. while recording. Asked him if he's in Ali Chopper. Yeah, are you in Ali? I asked you mad times. The fan then swung at Chopper and the screen went black and Chopper and the guy got into it a little. And after all of that ended, the fan was seen talking on the phone, explaining what he just did to NLE Chopper. I don't remember, I don't remember this happening, y'all. The rapper. 
Ain't hey, about nothing. Hey, big NBA, big 4K trail over here. Y'all feel me? Yeah, he just knocked out a rifle. And from the looks of it, <laughs> Chopper didn't get knocked out. He hey, even addressed man, the situation the on cap. social media, saying it's a difference from getting hit and falling than fighting in flip flops and falling on your own. Happened. I fell throwing a punch. I ain't get hit till I was on the way down, and my backpack 20 pounds. Chopper even spoke on the situation a little in an interview with Revolt, since they wanted to know more about how things went down. I ain't feel like doing all that. And so, boom, he said I was scared. He must have jumped at me. Now, the day I hit it, right in his mouth, came back with the left, hit him in the mouth again. Then when we squared up again, I swung through the left, hit him again. When I threw my right, my flip flop, like, <laughs> my <laughs> foot, like, I just felt my <laughs> ankles just give so out. So basically Rondo, what you're saying, you hit with a two-piece. After being bow, involved bow. with the passing of King Von. Then but that came ain't back the only issue again he's had in the, the streets. Left, though, back in 2019, bow, he was a legend like that in L.A. Kondo I'm used to claim Roman 60's neighborhood crib, but when the Hoovers checked <laughs> nah, him at the mall, shit. he told them he wasn't from anywhere. So they let him slide, but later, a picture surfaced on the internet, Kondo throwing up gang signs in LA. That's when a dude named Alshon Martin hopped on IG to air Kondo out. But one thing about oh, you, dog, when I get man. You, so that's what happened? I don't who behind you? I, I, I see a couple of your people trying to tap in and hit me through my DMs. <laughs> it's not working, bro. Just keep that same energy. You throwing up the set over there? Throw it up everywhere you go. Then in August 2022, Quando was in LA when three gunmen pulled up on him and started firing his way. Quando made it out without getting armed, but his homie Lil Pab unfortunately passed away on the scene. After Pab passed, Quando posted Dang, his IG story and said he was leaving the crip life behind. He said, My main man's gone and a lot more. I'm cool on a lot of. If I feel like you're not with me, there's no reason for me to be holding on to you. No need to shake your hand or fake something with you. Quando got clowned on social media for saying he's leaving the Crips, but it looks like he's just trying to focus on his music and stay out of the street <laughs> drama. Also, subscribe right quick if you enjoy this never video. Say that, we man. have to talk about when some goons try pressing little baby. Man, but first, they ain't never we have to talk about Soldier Boy bro. because he's always down Quando, for drama. Since in 2017, he was beefing with oh, Chris I thought Brown the video and wanted was to over. prove Shit. he still God, was man. respected in the streets. So we pulled up to the hood on IG Live, but it didn't go down like he thought it would, and he ended up getting checked. Soldier tried putting his arm around the dude, but the other guy <laughs> obviously wasn't feeling it and told Soldier Boy to get off of him. That's when Soldier put his phone down Man, and acted like he was gonna square up to hit with the guy. But the video cut off before anything really happened. But that ain't the only time Soldier Boy Man, got pressed because back in 2019, a video came out of Casanova checking him after they bumped into each other at Sirius XM. Apparently, Soldier had yelled at a lady before the video started and Casanova told him, Can you scream at a lady, you buck out, homie? And it looked like the situation was about to heat up. Soldier like Boy's security wanted Casanova to calm down. But luckily for Soldier and his they crew, nothing serious went down. But now, let's move on to when some goons in St. Louis tried checking Lil Baby because Lil Baby was getting ready for a show and lacing his shoes up. But the goons saw him and started talking crazy. So Lil Baby responded to the dude saying, What the talking about? Since he didn't know what was going on. But the goons were originally mad since Lil Baby was in their hood and didn't let them know what he was doing. And little baby stood his ground, even though he wasn't in his hood. <laughs> Thankfully, nothing bad happened. But I can't say the same about Detroit scam rapper TJX6, because TJ was very popular in 2019 after his song Dark Web blew up, where he talks about stealing identities and committing credit card fraud. He even recorded videos of him dropping checks at Wells Fargo. Damn, I remember all of that. That's my dude, man. I don't need no evidence. Hey, I ain't gonna cap to you. He really was like that on camera. Ain't no game. 
He, I remember that video. Yeah, last time, so I had to go into the bank. Right? He really walked in there and cashed out like that. But the scamming didn't take long to catch up to him because a couple of years ago, TJ posted Lil Baby's ID on his Instagram and said he was going to get rich off his name since he had all of his information. Fans warned him to take the post down since Baby is well respected in the streets. But TJ didn't listen and kept it up. Then a few days later, TJ was shopping in Lenox Mall in Atlanta when a bunch of goons ran up on him. A viral video came out showing TJ running away while the dudes tried to put their hands on him. No one was harmed in the situation, but TJ later hopped on IG Live and said he wasn't going to hang around to get whooped since he was outnumbered. 6 9 also had some problems with some Florida goons because on March 21st, 2023, <laughs> 6 9 was working out at an LA fitness in Florida until some goons at the gym spotted him followed him into the bathroom and started jumping him. And the guys didn't really say much. It was just on sight once they saw him. And many rappers had something to say after this happened in 6 9 because Boosie made a post saying, LMAO, snitches get stitches. A lot more rappers also laughed and joked about the situation. And I'm sure New York rappers are going to have a lot to say about this situation. But speaking of New York, check out this video to see the most disrespectful New York drill lyrics that really happened. Hey, it's a lot that happened there, man. Hey, funny video, but no disrespect to anybody that was involved in any of the uh, controversial situations that were partaking um, in this 10 minute and 39 second video here. Oh, but it was very funny and I found it very entertaining. And if you found it very entertaining, please, 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 just like the video. And if you want, subscribe. But it's your boy, D. Take note in there. Let's get it, silly butts. You, out of me and my partners right here, who would you smash, who would you marry, who would you kill? Smash, because you my match. Okay. I'm marrying you. Let me get a little three sisters. Let me see what I'm marrying, you see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Ooh. Um, kill, kill, kill. Damn. So he killing everybody. What's going on, Sleek Crew? Welcome back to the crazy YouTube channel on planet Earth for show. You know what I'm saying? Hey man, today's banger video, we're gonna be doing a smash, marry, kill with all of my YouTube friends. Hope you guys enjoy. Like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell button to get every notification to every banger video that I drop. Hey man, let's go. Today I'm here with It's me and that should be as you can motherfucking see. Yeah. So what's up YouTube? It's your girl Lisa and we back with another banger. Okay. <laughs> so y'all can follow me on Instagram at Lisa Diane L I S A D I A N N E E. God damn. What's up, y'all? It's your Did girl. Y'all can follow me on Instagram at P I M P C S S dot S H A E E. And my YouTube is in my bio. Don't forget to subscribe. Big dream, not the fucking little one. Period. Uh, big dream, not the little one. Shay Shay. I'm Aya. Selena. What's going on, YouTube? Man, it's your boy Avery B. Today I'm taking over for my boy Slit Show. Pete Game. But first question Do you mind rank all three of us 1 through 10? I don't mind. Put, put us down right quick. Avery B. You sexy. You just small. You. You cute. I'll f you. You. You know you fine. Appreciate you. Oh, that's it? You can get nobody no rating, though. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, God. Now that I think about it, man, what? You said one through ten. <laughs> you gave okay. everybody a compliment, though. All right. Yeah. All right, you a ten. You were really an eight because you small. I'm a tall ass. Man, you what? She loose. <laughs> so I'm gonna say I'm gonna say I put your shoes heavy in the chain. I'm gonna give you like a 8.59. So don't drip I see and I like your chains in your watch. So I'm gonna say you like a and your nails, I like your nails, 8.529. I already told him I like his eyes. And then he gave me where he said you from? I'm from Atlanta. You give me Atlanta, like Atlanta give like you can tell that he from Atlanta, like I'm gonna give you like a nine because he remind me of a he remind me of a pit bull. 
Like them people. <laughs> that way. You know how people have them eyes? He don't have like, like, let me see. He, his eyes just, I love, I love eyes. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna give you a seven. Or eight. I'm gonna give you a nine. One to ten, one to ten. I'm gonna give you an eight. Don't be acting shy. You got a big personality. Okay, I'm gonna give you an eight too. And you was my match, so you get a ten. I got a question for you. I like her energy. Who would you smash? Who would you marry? Who would you kill? Um. <laughs> you look like a nerd. Damn. <laughs> Hey! Eat these on fire. Have you fooled the motherfucker? I thought she was trying to get over. smash you. <laughs> Damn. Last but not least. And I'm gonna murder your ass, nigga. <laughs> but you're not ugly though, you know that. You already know him. Hey, I'm weak as fuck. Smash for sure. Respectfully. <laughs> He gonna smash. Ain't about ass, nah. Exactly. Hey, hey, exactly. Exactly. And that's why I'll pass. Damn. Damn. Oh, damn. That's tough. Out of ask three, who you smash, who you marry, who you kill. Emotional I'm damage. I'm gonna marry you and I'm gonna kill you. Damn, bro, got two kills in this video. Okay. I'm gonna kill you. I'm sorry. And this is video. I'm gonna smash you and I'm gonna marry you. <laughs> Smash, Mary kill. Smash, cause you my match. Okay. Okay. Mm. Don't be looking me up and down like that. <laughs> oh, you said a Leo already. What's your son? Damn. I'm addicted to earth signs. Mary, kill. Bye, I fuck with you. Don't trip. Don't trip. And she didn't hit us up. Um, I like her. A giant peak. Respectfully, I love girls, so. So you're gay? Gay as fuck. I'm gonna say this though, like, hypothetically speaking, if we had to repopulate the earth, what are we doing? Um, I fuck okay. with y'all bitches. Well, if us. we had to. It's only y'all, silly butt. What are you it. talking about? Then I'm gonna fuck y'all. But not the way that y'all want. <laughs> oh no! Man, what is she talking about? Okay, cool. So look, out of us three, who is you smashing? Who is like Loki, who invited her? Smash Mary Kill. <laughs> yeah. I'm marrying you. Oh, I know who you're marrying. Let me get a little three sixes. Let nah, me see what I'm marrying. You know what I'm saying? That's a three sixes. Girl, you better start touching before I get wild in this hole. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> All right, so who you all marrying? I'm killing the I'm gonna marry you. I like having sex with females. <laughs> So I'm gonna fuck you. <laughs> you know you my dog. Well, at least she did it right this time. So the first time, she's supposed to rate him one through ten. Out of us three, who are you smash, marry, and killing? I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, smash. I'm gonna say, marry. I'm gonna say kill. Actually, I don't know. Can I do like, do I have to kill somebody? Yeah. No, nah, you don't gotta kill nobody. Okay. Do uh, smash, marry, kiss. Okay, yeah, yeah, I like that. Smash, marry, kiss. <laughs> like you, gotta, you gotta kiss him then. On the cheek? Yeah. Kiss him on the cheek. Type shit. And this and since you kiss her, that means you gotta smash. <laughs> be for real, be for real. Out of us three, who you smashing, who you marrying, who you killing? Smashing, marrying, killing? Mm. Marrying, that's deep. That's deep. Everything, killing. Everything she complete yeah, everything opposite happened. from the last hypothetical. girl. What? Hypothetical. Hypothetical though. His accent. Hypothetical though. Okay, let me see. Uh, excellent. Who can I make my husband? Ooh, I'ma kill you. I'ma kill you. Damn. You just look so mean. Like you like you kill me, so I'ma kill you. You feel me? I'm kill you. Man, first. what? Uh, hmm. I'ma. Uh, I don't know who wilder, her or the other like girl with the braids, the light skin. I think her name is Selena. That's her name. No, I don't like that. I, I want her to say Mary so bad. <laughs> Smash him. No, but like I'm saying, like we like, you feel me? 
<laughs> but you like you you trippy though, like you you vibing. But I'm a, I'm a smash, marry and kill because I guess so we can have some cute little chocolate kids. You feel me? Okay, okay. I mean, I hope y'all enjoy this very video, man. <laughs> hey man, it's your boy DK Nero with the reactions, baby. Let's get it. Silly butt.